представляю соперников. И первый бойца в синем углу. Introducing to you first hiding out of the blue corner. Ему 28 лет. Рост 190 сантиметров, вес 93 килограмма ровно. Профессиональный рекорд 12 побед, 7 поражений. И его стиль ударная техника. Ladies and gentlemen, he's 28 years old. He stands 190 сантиметров tall. Fish weight 93 килограмм 7. As a striker with professional record 12 victories and 7 defeats. Ladies and gentlemen, from Twain, Russia, Roman Kutachkin. Его соперник в красном углу. He's a born and fighting at the red car. Бойцу 38 лет. Его рост 177 сантиметров. Вес 93 и 35 сотых килограмма. Он специалист по бразильскому чоу-джитсу с профессиональным рекордом 17 побед, 4 поражения. Ladies and gentlemen, he's 38 years old, standing. 177 centimeters tall, official weight 93.35 kilos. As Brazilian jiu-jitsu specialist, professional record 17 victories and 4 losses. Дамы и господа, ladies and gentlemen, from Boston, Russia, Pivis Mohammed Ahushev. And the referee in charge, Lukas Pazowski. Lukas Pazowski will take charge of this light heavyweight contest. We look at the numbers there, height and reach on the side of Roman Godochkin, but look at that, 38 years versus 28 years. Ten years the younger is Roman Godochkin. Mohamed Aushev returning to the cage. He is in the black and green shorts. Red corner taking on Godochkin in the blue corner. That's the thing here. I mean, Aushev has very good kicks. He, at the moment, yeah, there you go. I'm wanting to see a bit more head movement because when you've been moving up, like, sometimes you're not going to get used to when you're getting hit by these heavier guys. It is, oh. it, 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 you know, you do feel the big the difference. From what I understand and from the uh, the information we've taken from the last fight and the fact that uh, Amir uh, Goliath is in his corner, well, he's cheering him on here and he was in the corner of Goliath against Roman Godochkin. I'm guessing they train, they spar together. Goliath is a legit light heavyweight as well, so... But this is all about the game of Aushev. This is how he likes to win his fights. You look at his records, big wins against the likes of Imanali, Gamzatanov, Ramazan, Emiev, Roland Campbell. Textbook take down here, doing a great job. The knee slide as well, straight through to half guard. Five, sorry, eight of his thir 13 finishes are by submission. Four of those, nice, yeah, he's trying to isolate the arm there, oh, going straight into mount. Straight this into is mount. beautiful stuff, Brian. And this is for a man that's not fought inside the cage since 2017. And that was at middleweight, now at light heavyweight. Yeah. He could set this up for the arm. He's, he's not rushing. He's setting up the he's arm bar, Brad. I don't, I don't, actually, I don't know if he's going to be rushing for this. He's going to try and soften up a little bit more. With elbows and stuff like that. Oh, short elbows. Heavy shots coming in. Look this, at the top control, the base he's got. This is beautiful. And it shows that it's not always about size, it's about technique. No, because Roman is definitely the big over too. Oh, 100%. Look at the control here from Aushev. I say, Aushev must have saw this in the last fight. It's where Roman had a lot of trouble in that last fight when he got taken to the mat. Oh, look how oh, high this is. God. Look how high. This is horrible here for Roman Godochkin. Aushev rolling back the clock yeah. with this performance. He's trying to bring up his legs to try and make it hard for him, but he's, he's so high, he's maybe going for, he's he's going going to go for the arm bar now. He's trying to set up one. Look at the base of the control and the shots coming down. If this is his last fight, come on. This is such a perfect performance so far, Brad. Yeah. We can get one more out of this guy, right? We can get one more. <laughs> let's have a tile run. Let's go for, let's go for the tile. Or whatever, whatever weight class you like. <laughs> go up and up a weight class. This is oh, it, this could be it. This could be it, finishing with strikes, heavy shots. Lukas Pazowski on top of this. Can he get the finish? Yeah. He needs to pick him a bit more now at the moment. There's just too many volume That there. is it, wow! Oh, Chef returns to the cage victorious. Did not 13 even, yeah. fight win streak, Brad, now. 38 years of age and, and the man did not even break a sweat. Textbook.
textbook uh, start to finish. You said to me he must have seen something when he was in the corner. He, exactly that, Brad. The way he took it straight to the mat. But look at the control he had. Look at the level of the grappling, yes. the passes, then the high mount. Yeah, but what impressed me, because obviously Roman's a lot of bigger guy. Sometimes when you have that sort of strength, you can just throw people off, not with technique, but just with sure muscle mass. But he, he was able to control him and really nullify anything. Roman was not a, a sitting duck, by the way. He was trying to get out using a lot, a lot of... Basically, this goes that first takedown. Look at that. That was beautiful. Body lock, little twist takedown here. Straight into side control, knee through it, through it to mount. And that was it. Then he worked his way up from this mount position. Sometimes we thought he was maybe going to go for an armbar, but he opted just to strike and get the finish. Well, Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Lukas Basaski stopped the fight after three minutes and five seconds of the first round. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee in charge, Lukas Basaski, stops this contest at three minutes and five seconds of round number one. Technical knockout. Добивание. Победу одержал. And the winner by technical knockout, punches. Mohamed. Oh, shit.